when I'm in a competition, there's lots of things that I do as part of my routine. When I'm at the bottom of the stairs, I have my drinks bottle there. So I take a, a swig of my drinks bottle and then that's when I start to go up the stairs. And as I'm going up the stairs, I think about the dive that I'm doing, think about how I'm going to make it the best I can, how I'm going to do it to the best of my ability. And then when I get to the five meter, which is the halfway point, that's when I do a mental run through. I cover my eyes with my chamois and I practice and visualize what I'm going to do in my head. So I have my eyes shut and in theory I've done the dive before, before I've even gone up there. And then on the seven meter, which is the board just before the 10 meter, I stand there and I do my physical run through where I actually do the arm swing, I do the twisting actions, I do the somersaulting actions. So then I've gone through it in my head and I've gone through it physically so that by the time I get onto 10 meter, I just have to walk to the end, turn around, think about the dive one more time and then just take a, take the leap, I guess. <laughs> This thing around my shoulders is called a chamois. It's something that every diver has. It prevents them from injury and it stops them from getting cold. It's a thing that you have in between each dive. Normally we dry ourselves off so that when we're spinning around in our shapes, we don't slip out and cause ourselves injuries. When I stand on the end of the board in competitions, normally I have to be very focused on what I need to do, thinking about the process of the dive, not thinking too much about the outcome of it, but thinking about standing there, what I need to do to get a good dive, I think about the takeoff because that's a very important thing that you need to be able to do, and then you think about the different techniques that you do in the air, the come out, the entry, the shapes, and all things like that, so there's lots of things to think about. I always get nervous during competitions, but it's something that you get used to and you're able to manage and you turn it into adrenaline and good nerves, you could say. My favourite thing about being a diver is that every training session is different, everything that we do is fun. The adrenaline that we get is just so much more than what you would do, say, if you were doing homework, so it's just something that I love doing.